So we got up really early this morning because something that we used to love to do when we lived on the Sunshine Coast is get up really early and come to the beach at Mooloola Bar and go for a swim. But we haven't done that for hmm, 12, 10, 12 years. And we've come down this morning and there's a lot more people living on the Sunshine Coast now. And of course, there's a lot more people at the beach, but it's still really beautiful. We're gonna go for an early morning swim and have breakfast, just like we used to do. And we're gonna take you with us. I hope that you can feel like you're having a swim too. Can you see these people that are doing laps? I heard some of them talking that they're training for marathons or triathlons, things like that. Mooloolaba does have a really big famous one every year. So maybe some of them are training for that. But it's beautiful in the water right now. It's quarter past seven in the morning and it's 28 degrees outside. When we used to come down here, it was May and we'd come down at six in the morning and the water temperature used to be 23 degrees. I have no trouble floating, so I'm actually just floating where I am right now. So you can see Maruchidor over there. You can see Malula Bar just there. There's someone with a paddle board. Whenever we come to Malula Bar, we always come, you see Malula Bar down there, and we always walk all the way up the moon shape curve there's Paul we always come up this end because it's so much quieter and the water is very calm so when you're actually in front of the shops on the Esplanade at Malula Bar at that part of the beach there's always waves and there's a few rocks down there but up this end it's always really pretty calm it's beautiful so I hope you're enjoying this swim, even though I'm not taking you under the water. Let's see how deep I am now. I uh, can't touch the bottom now, but that's okay. I hope you really enjoyed this swim, but I have to go in now. But before I do, have a look at these paddle boards. I've always wanted to do this. I think that's so awesome, isn't it? Can you see them? Let's swim back, shall we? I am just waiting for the cameraman to come back. How was your swim? Oh, yeah, great. It's beautiful. I didn't want to get out really. <laughs> that was lovely. It's perfect temperature. I think the water temperature is about 25, 26. And it's about um, 28, 29 already. And it's only, what, 7.30, 8 o'clock? But it's beautiful. This is a great spot. I mean, we used to come here all the time, as I think you've said. Walk our dogs and all that sort of thing when we live near here. It's perfect, perfect morning for it. It's great and it's not that far from where we live really so it's great reminisce old times <laughs> that was so nice it was beautiful the temperature of the water and when we came out there's actually less people on the beach than when we arrived so it's just such a lovely thing to do isn't it to go for a swim first thing in the morning and we've got a few mozzie bites from being out in the garden and there's nothing like the salt water is there to kind of make them feel a bit less itchy, I guess. I mean, haven't had a coffee yet, so let's go show you what you can have for breakfast in Mooloola Bar.
What have you got? A blat. Bacon, lettuce, avocado. I don't know what the tea tomato. is. Tomato. Oh, tomato. Of course. And eggs benny on top. Yeah, looks mm. delicious. Mm. Well that was a great start to the day. There's nothing better than going for a swim on Mooloolaba Beach and then having breakfast. And Mooloolaba of course has so many great memories for us because we both used to work here. And when we're spending time here today, we're just reminiscing about the time we spent down here, working down here, but most of all, we think about the fantastic people we used to work with. We worked with a really great team and I don't know if any of them are watching our videos, but if they are, we, we want to send them a big hello. So we hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you next week.